I was playing against Savage to Blues Rock, yeah. Wayward Terran Frontier soundtrack. By the way, in the near future, we're going to be looking at a lot of uh, Star Wars ships like this. Because we will be doing a Star Sector with the Star Wars mod. Uh, Wayward Terran Frontier Zero Falls is the full name. It is a top down, um, kind of space survival ish RPG thing. Cool little game, that's what it is. You wonder why your frame rate goes down when there's battles like this going on everywhere. An odd name, yeah. It's basically WTF Zero Falls. Uh, I've done a playthrough of it. So it's kind of like um, Star Sector in the sense that you can customize your ships and everything. It's top down, but you are actually a, a single crew member. And uh, you can go in and out of your ship and stuff. Hold on. Let me do the thing. Do some self advertisement, yeah. Why not? Uh, if I go to my content. Playlists. Oh my god, how long ago was this? There it is. No, I don't want to edit it. I know you can't see what I'm doing, but trust me, I'm doing stuff. It's mad. I'm gonna mute that ad. Then we're gonna do this. Unmute this. Oh. Using the station's matter furnace and various nano lathing. This is when my mic Just will be louder. We can, uh, we'll learn that. So yeah, you walk around. You right click while you're in a shop, it'll just trade back and forth. So when you come out, you can right click to learn things. It's gonna be weird if I'm explaining things over explaining things. But like, yeah, you can go into the stations, uh, you can go around to like abandoned stations around the universe and stuff. Um, you fly around. When you zoom out, you get this view, but uh, so here there's different types of ships and you can customize these builds all together. As in, like, strip them out completely. Customize everything inside the hull. There's a bit of research. But, uh, no, it's, it's, um, it's a fun game. Yeah, there's a... An entire series on it there, along with all of these others. Anyway, let's close that and uh, make sure I'm not dying in X4. So we're trying to get to Teth. Just way down south. This is what these cruisers are great for. They're snipers. They just remind me of Covenant ships now with that new color. Oh 
Might take them a while, but they'll get it done down there. Bunch of stations, but it's telling me I need to go to a system, so there should be a gate down here somewhere. Their fighting will continue. Yeah, I was about to say, I think I just saw it. I don't know what triggers the event for Camino or anything like that, but um, go down and pay them a visit regardless. service we should probably just head straight through the big system so we didn't get the gate on the scan that's fine playing a xylophone While this is going on, our traders are finishing their duties. So hopefully we can set them up again soon. Be that one. Duties. straight shot the one thing I don't know about uh, custom starts where do you go to select Having the gates known. There it is. Something loaded in there. I don't think I can attack that. Wait, fly to Molivar, really?
I guess it's this one. There's a, um, I was saying yesterday when we were looking at city skylines, it's like I want to see the um, resources. Like, can you actually just manage them properly yourself? That would be cool to me. I know you technically can by just, you know, producing enough. I want to see how in-depth it goes. Firmino. As in our previous run, if we want to be really cool and get all the blue lasers, we come here. Oh, also we can get edit twos here, can't we? Probably can't yet, but yeah. Pretty sure the thing being is that all we need to do is get our wrap up with them and then um, pay them. <laughs> I'd say there's a lot of that going on. Alright, kill any black sun ships, we can do that. Always take those missions in the background if you're an enemy to them. No point in not getting paid for it. Oh, does this mean I... Do you know what? I can get the, my wing to attack the mines as well. If I ever wanted them to. Which I don't, because they'll probably run into them. Watched, I watched like 20 minutes of it and then I fell asleep so I was going to watch more of it tonight and see the, the thing with me now is because like I don't do this full time so I really weigh up I'll try to weigh up 
what I can play. Like even like naval action. I want to I want to do more naval action. I want to do more Star Citizen. But I want to do more X4. But I want to do more Baldur's Gate 3. But I want to do Cyberpunk. Like I don't And then there's all the other games that I would like to go back to. It's like Then along the lines of like city skylines, I want to do workers and resources because that's had a few updates. Um, I'm waiting for Out of Ore to update a bit. Uh, don't shard is going to have an update soon, hopefully. Oh god, I get like two to three hours a day max to stream. That's all I do at the moment is sleep, work, stream. Just need about 100 hours to your day, yeah. Pretty much. But that's my routine now is um, I get up, get some to eat, stream for a few hours until I have to go to work. I do the drive to work. Come back. Sleep for a bit, wake up, get something to eat for a bit, go to work. That is currently my life. Hey, Shiver. What am I driving? I'm driving an XJ3-5 X-Wing. Camino. Gone and uh, checked out the mall again. So now I want to go to Manda and I want to get a route back to Milagro, which shouldn't be bad. Or did you mean my car? <laughs> yeah, let's set this up actually and see how we get there. Find a way to Bothawi. Yeah, okay. and the Republic are now at war. It's great, it means more targets for us. I wonder if that's going to slow them down. <clears throat> so uh, the Republic have began attacking Pax. They've also taken Runa. It's much more than they did in the last uh, version. We bought a few more fighters to replace our losses. We're probably going to go with the XJs from now on. Excuse me again. Yeah, that should be that one there. And then... Does Lerator go straight into Malagro? If it does, that's great. <clears throat> I don't think it does, though.
Boop. Hi, I'm scanning you for no reason whatsoever. Maybe I'm not scanning you. There we go. Two hundred and twenty six. Ah, find a way to Mount Gaza. Okay. Mining Guild, Tide Fighter Rex. Who's fighting the Mining Guild? That pirate that was next door? I always have this memory of um, X3 Star Wars that I was flying up to a gate and a Venator came through and crashed into me and killed me. And I was like, oh, lovely. Any reason they don't upgrade to uh, more survival craft? Money. <laughs> uh, we're making a bit of money because we have no production. And I need to make 32 million to get the uh, blueprint for the maintenance bay because I didn't give it to myself in the custom start by accident. Because we definitely had it the last day. So, um, yeah. The added hardship to myself. seeing can I actually see those stations that's not the one I'm after might as well find the bounty hunter guild while we're here it's not that one could be that one I've actually lost two x-wings we're now in the uh, xj35 this is it, yeah. Okay, perfect. Here, let's send into your trader. Will anyone care? He shot right back. He also abandoned his ship. No, wait. Hot cartel? It's growing on you? I like it. You're not hot cartel. Oh, you are hot cartel. Okay. The evening is in. But I know you were there for the overview. You know that one that took four hours? 
Um, go here. So there's the evening stats on the high settings. Bit tankier. Oh, you think you missed? Really? I thought I thought was it not you then that was wooing for the e wing? Must have been someone else. Don't worry, the video's up on YouTube. <laughs> Um, but yeah, that's the Ewing there. What we do is actually check the price of it. Then we go to Alderaan. Do they use the Ewing? No, of course they don't. Why would they? I need to go to you. The E-Wing is the standard fighter that you can buy. Well, exactly, Traff, yeah. It's only there for people that want to... It's only a look at the models anyway, it's not a look at the stats. We don't go into the stats. That's the whole other thing that would require all the fits being right and everything. The E-Wing will cost you 900,000. So it's a cheaper... Cheaper variant, basically, of the X-Wing. In this, which it's supposed to be, right? It's supposed to be like a standardized... Cheap version of the X-Wing. Be an 8-hour video? That, uh, possibly. Because then you'd have to go in and like, test weapons. I was thinking of doing all the weapons, but then I thought against it. Like, no, I'm, I'm not. No. Go get them, boys. I've set them on an attack. We can catch it. I've considered um, fortifying this system. You know, we're probably mounting defense impacts. They're not attacking packs, they're mounting a defense impacts. Ascendancy don't like us. Um, a little less so, yes. in Mongaza, you say? Why pirates, you say? Yes, do attack him. Borax, 38. Oh, no. The bong. The bong are active. Uh, 
Uh, another reason I'm going to be in an, a fighter for a while is I like to be able to directly command a group of fighters. Ball gone bomb. That's a hit. Is that an active one? We shall see. It's all gone bonk for this P-38. He has no idea what he's getting into. Don't know if he can even beat the Lambda, to be honest. He's not even attacking the Lambda. What is he doing? He's afraid. There's the V-Wing and everything. Excellent. Oh, the station is attacking the P-38. Nice. That bodes well for me attacking it. Accuracy by volume of fire. Hit the V-Wing. Everyone attack. Again, I just use the mouse button to tell my guys to attack. I love. I stop attacking because he's close to the station. Just in case anyone is curious. Going to control. Going to general. Go all the way down here. A wing, attack my target or resume assignment. I have put these on my mouse buttons. And I have my wing set to defense. They are in, yes. They replace the uh, crystals. Or the crystalline. Well. Were the cac crystalline or insectoid? I want to say crystalline like the um like the Tholians. Oh were they were insectoid? Okay. So yeah, the the Vong replaced them. Yeah, I like having my um, my wing on defense. Just so they don't go off attacking everything. And um, then I can give them a specific target, which is nice. So our Lambda should be fine. Our X-Wings just jumped in beside us. Just awesome. Uh, the Xenon are in as an unknown threat at the moment. Until they get something to replace them. They just haven't done it yet. They, they're not active. They don't have a faction or anything. They just um, show up around one of the PHQs. Right. Who? Oh, Acclimator is doing nothing. What? No, no, no. People want to buy module prefabs. We should be selling them module prefabs. Yes, go spend 4.8 million on those module prefabs and then make me a bit more money. That price isn't great, but do it anyway. And then anything you have left over, we're just going to transfer into here. And the boys. And, uh,. He, they're ready to sell them whenever we can. So for you, I need to calm you. you picked up a... Didn't I pick up a two-star management seminar? 
I was sure I did. Uh, inventory. S seminar for two star crew. Huh? Given the piloting, just why not? But you've one and a half stars in management. Excuse me. You've one and a half stars in management. Our two trader pilots are better managers than our manager. Okay, let's be actually um, thorough. Our Pelta class, one of our service crew is one of our best managers on our Pelta class. Work somewhere else for me. Okay, so let's fire that guy. Um, God damn you. Then we're going to go in here. So we're actually going to play the game. I never go into these details. Okay. So... His morale is huge as well. Engineering is great. Management is only one and a half stars, but that's okay. Because it's better than the other guy that was there. Now I can give him a two star crew piloting. Oh, so he has to get the two stars and then I give him the seminar? Okay. The way I read that is like, this will give him two stars in that thing shield component are selling for 94 credits and being bought for 264 credits I think we can live with that and probably get a bunch of people doing this run Nobody will need shield components ever again. There we go. Hi, Finley. Um, Alta. So then, if I get these guys to mimic. Right? I don't know how Mimic works in this regard. So, like, I'm gonna do weapon components, right? You do a load of weapon components, and then you sell all the weapon components. See, they're not gonna be able to do that. Oh, and people are buying the module prefabs. We'll get rid of them. Thank you. So it probably doesn't work for trading, right? Because they won't go off and do what he's doing. Unless they're set to, like, mimic someone that's on an auto-trade or something. Oh, we're following the acclimator. Cool. So I don't think there's any point in them being on mimic, right? Uh, 
can just have them on follow. Ooh, they're selling for 1600. I don't really care about them selling for 1600 because these guys will eventually sell them. And um, I want field coils on that list. Yep, so I can troll click to that. Let's put field coils on the list. You can just get rid of all the stuff he picked up first. All the pews, yes. We'll definitely get back to pewing. Um, oh, what I want to do then is remove that. Put back into trade. Oh, he still only has one? Okay. Pilot skill is terrible, that's why. <laughs> oh, sorry, I need to stretch. So, can I give you anything else? I probably already looked at this. No. We need better pilots in there. Stalker Gamma. Definitely eventually, yeah. Uh... Oh, wow. Our new manager is our most experienced captain. Service crew don't get... Um... Wait, who's the captain of the acclimator then? Captain of the acclimator is one star. Okay. Hmm. Average personnel skill is three and a half stars in what? Oh. Oh, our Marines are good. Okay, we have good Marines. Um, X War is a chill game, though. But we're still kind of setting ourselves up. Also, I'm flying, aren't I? Wait. Our super secret rebel base is classed in the trade station. That's good. Right then, we need to get these guys doing stuff. Again, shield components being sold for 100. To make 230 in profit, yeah, that'll do. Like what? 
two hundred in profit there. That will do nicely. So we'll get him to do like three runs of that. Margin has come down on that. Dura seal plates at 118, 127. Oh wait, field coils, 197 and 478. That was 163,000. Oh damn. Yeah, let's do that. Price on field cuts, good. Seventy six. I know there wasn't money in that, but that's fine. Pop it up. That's not bad. So we have like six point four million coming in now in trade. Let's use some of the bigger ships then to start getting those numbers up. That's crazy. Um, Acclimator. You have a bunch of trades too. That's fine. Gonna buy four thousand of them. Make us one point two million in profit. So he has a bunch of stuff to do. That's nine million coming in. That's crazy. You're selling your field coils, so we'll get you to start doing that too, just to get some experience. Even the even the YT thirteen hundred is making what eighty thousand profit a run. Not nearly ninety thousand profit a run just on field coils. That's crazy. So we're just gonna get him to do a bunch of runs. If other people are gonna be slow about the uptake. That's their own fault. We have a private war to fund. And then the Lambda. 264 and 121. It's not bad, but it just doesn't compare to that. Watch out prefabs is like a 400. And then the weapon components. Still the field cars are the best. Lambda has slightly less capacity than the uh, YT. But it is the captured ship. You make 40,000 on the weapon components, and you're making, what, 70 something thousand on the field coils? Yeah. We have 9 million coming in trade at the moment. You could do a few more runs. Kind of losing it now, but uh, that's fine. I'll do that. No, we're not doing that.
without the shield components. Even at that, you're starting to eke into your margin a bit too much. How many jurors still plates can you hold? 445,000 worth. Sixty-one in profit. Fifty-one in profit. Okay, that's not bad. Your still plates are not bad. If you could sell them in bulk, that'd be great. Fine, but yeah, eleven million now. Eleven point four million coming in in trade. Which will do nicely. Close that. Oh, I kind of want to... I need to go check this beacon. If it's dormant, we're okay for now. Um, but we'll see. This isn't a terrible idea at all. Hydrate? Yes, thank you. Also, that did not appear on the scan. Why not? Armed. Oh, beautiful. Sorry, hold on. Yuzhan Vong armed beacon. Get rid of that before all the annoying voices come back. Cool, it's armed. Great. I'm curious then if these guys are. Um, if there are people mining in the system, I'm wondering. But I haven't seen any Vong actually appear yet. Still in there. It's kind of nuts. It kind of plays into the fact that now, if we can get established, if we can get established. Do we push into Kira? Then, of course, um, Yagdol is going to be under attack from Anuad as well.
so that'll be a thing. I've done much exploring in here, so I'm just doing a ping to see if there's anything in this area. know of this station. <laughs> Six defense platforms. Feel we could take it out with bombers. I think we could take it out pretty easily with a decent group of bombers. That uh, like a CSS one with the funky windscreen. <coughs> it is one of our traders doing his work. Possibly be our YT thirteen hundred. It is indeed because it has a Taladi pilot. <clears throat> Oh yeah, <clears throat> our long probe waving. Scouting out all of the New Republic. So that we can get those trades. The long probe has been in for a while, yeah. Scout variant. slow spy plane probably because you don't have access to probe droids it's what you got you know
Let's uh, jump over to Yagdal. Massage Ventress. Look at this peaceful Shardan. With the Republic factories in it. Actually, before we go in, we might as well check. That was the wrong one. I meant to do this. Hmm. I'm thinking that the Animata are going to bring in a fleet at some stage. Unless the Republic has started pushing in there too, which, you know, is possible. Let me teach you a lesson. Sounds good. Go over and say hello to the Pelta. So what's the setting that does the reflections on the carpet glass? I might turn it off because it keeps blinking every now and then. He's just hanging out. We do own a CR90, which I could use, but I do want to keep it as um, a defense patrol around our station. Wait, is that ours? Oh, well, we'll never know. Got a Gallifrey and Acclimator. things.
Wait a minute. I'm gonna save it there. And uh, we'll continue it on again soon. Probably Saturday. <laughs>